The family of two pedestrians killed on Bluff Street near the intersection of 500 North, two days apart, is still reeling from the losses, according to Valerie Jones, whose sister, 37-year-old Mardell Parkin, was killed on Wednesday evening, while her brother, 36-year-old Matthew Jones, was killed on Friday in the same intersection by a different driver two evenings later. Joanne said that when their sister was killed, that she and her brother Matthew were together at the same intersection, comforting one another on Wednesday. And little did she know that she would be back there two days later when he was killed while crossing the street. Two separate accident reconstruction investigations were opened following each of the incidents. And at this point, the driver of the pickup truck involved in Wednesday's incident was working with investigators and has not been charged following the incident. While the driver involved in Friday's crash, identified as 28-year-old Brianna Lee Waters of Washington City, was arrested late Friday night under suspicion of felony DUI, as well as second degree felony negligence that resulted in a death offense. She remains in custody without bail. When Jones was asked how she was managing in the aftermath of the devastating losses, she said that she was having a difficult time wrapping her head around what had happened and that for now, she said she's just going from moment to moment. This is Cody Blowers reporting for St. George News, your number one source for local news.